back live from the woods here. Well, I'm in Lanark still. I stood around and talked for, I don't know, a good hour there at uh, Lanark Small Engine. So he's gonna play around with the bike. He's still got another hour before he closed. So he said he's gonna put the air filter back on and play and see what happens uh, with the air screw. We, apparently I can't get at that air screw easily. And I said, well, I said, then I'm not, I said, once you got it adjusted, we'll leave it alone. If it needs adjusting again, I'll just bring it back again. I said, but you know, maybe I'll just ride it here and we can do it on the fly or something. But anyways, I could have had the bike probably back today if I'd gone way earlier, but I didn't. So that's the, uh, that's that. So, so now I'm just heading over to the gas bar, get some gas. Cause I do not want to run out cause that's happened twice now in the last while. So I pretty much had enough of running out of gas. And then I'm going to stop at the little store and, uh, I don't know, thinking about dinner here for later. Because they've got a fair at, at Little Pretty Goods here. Pretty Goods is kind of like an old school grocery store. It's bigger than a corner store, obviously, but it's not a full size. Imagine AMP back in the 70s, but a tad smaller. And that's what Pretty Goods is for us out here. So it saves a lot of trips going to the big store in uh, Perth. And you would think that the, uh, the, the prices are way more expensive there. You'd be wrong. Surprise, surprise. It's going to be funny if I run out of gas just as I What's all this? Is this for sale or just junk? Garage sale. <laughs> Two vacuums there. Almost like the ones I have. I should probably go buy one just for the cats. Oh, I guess I should have bought gas. Can you guys see that? Dollar sixty fucking three. Just in time for the weekend. I'll be back. Hey everyone, I just had to back up a little bit so I get a right hand turn, but lots of traffic, it's a uh, quarter after, uh, what time is it? Updating phone book, I don't know why it updates every single time, nothing ever is updated in my phone book, that I'm aware of, jeez these computers, it's, uh, it's 420, I should have stopped there and seen, I don't have any cash, I don't, I don't even think I have my emergency. Ten? No, I do not. So, in my emergency twenty, did I use it or is it here? Or no, I think it's at home still. Anyway, put fifty in and it gave me a range of two hundred and thirty-two kilometers. Uh, the last time I did that, well, it's hard because you don't know how much gas I still had in it. Pretty much empty, the same as now. But um, it gave me two hundred and forty-seven. Anyway, oh, look at this, the guy ahead of me in that van might be a guy I want to fucking smack because he owes me money, because he fucked me around on my plumbing. Yeah, that looks like the little prick right there. Let's hope he stops at Pretty Goods. Well guys, I may have to turn this camera off, but I want my money. Works for Valley Plumbing here in Lanark. His name is uh, Green, Paul Green. The little fucker ripped me off big time. Left me in the lurch in the middle of the winter with my well. I could have lost everything. You know, things freezing up and everything. Didn't have water an extra four months because of him. Yeah, not exactly my best friend, if you know what I mean. Used to be a friend. Used to give him all kinds of free weed, like meaning just, you know, because uh, it's like, oh, hey, come on over. I know you smoke. Here, have some, you know, for free. I didn't sell or anything like that. He was always happy to take it, of course. Anyway, fuck him. And he didn't stop here at the store. Maybe it was new, it was me. I just don't know if he knew I had the new truck or not, so. 
A lot of people do know because they say this truck's good looking, and I guess it is. Looks like a truck to me, I don't know anything special about it. Anyway, I'll be back.